I would love to look over that paperwork. What, what I'm saying is whether it's accepted or not, I will not participate in the corruption of selective enforcement. I will not open myself up to fraud, especially when I have tried to civilly engage these people. And they, they constantly bring people down to help, and yet the fruits of their action is harm. It is, is absolute harm. So I, I would love to look over that paperwork. Something tells me that is going to be acceptable but not legal, and, and I will not participate in illegal activities. Because I, I already did. Like they told to me to move in 72 hours, and I moved, and they stole my van. And like, I'd like to say I have five kids, nine and under. This is so ridiculous. And what no, I would like to say is that paperwork isn't always followed either. Right now, we're dealing with they, they stole our van. And when I looked at the paperwork on the back, I followed it word for word. I have video evidence of me requesting a hearing. An, an appeal, appeal hearing. hearing. And they're Absolutely. denying. And, and they said that they have 48 hours to respond, and they did not respond within the 48 hours. So we called and we tried to report our advance stolen because, again, they did not have, have sufficient proof they, they that they legally. Legally. But they so don't care because we're homeless. Care. So now they said, well, we can't well, we, we afford can't, an attorney, we're not so, do it, so Now we're trying to wait for another call back from a deputy that may or may not be able to do anything because, again, they don't care. Even though I went word for word on that paper, Absolutely, and, and I don't have it off the top of my head. Last time uh, Kabelka came over, I actually had the city's definition of parking, but Black's Law Dictionary would, would be the, the dictionary in which you define words for court in a legal sense. And when I did look up the definitions for residential address, that would not be sufficient. This is where an entity, a, a, a legal fiction, whether it's a business or a person's, right? Where a legal fiction is actually registered and resides so I would love to look over the paperwork, but I'm telling you right now, I'm fairly certain that when I look it up legitimately, like to the actual definition of words, not just kind of some feels type thing, that it's probably going to be extremely inappropriate. Extremely inappropriate. You know, and I, I definitely thank you for the, the mail service. I think that's a lovely service that you guys provide for the homeless. But, but yeah, trying to state that somewhere is a residence when you're not sleeping there, you're not taking showers there, you're not cooking there, you know, when you don't have a place to lay your head, it, it, it would, in my mind, be a false claim. And again, I would be more than willing to look at that up. Are Absolutely. Guys, are you guys advised by legal people when she's, when she's consumed in public? Oh, you're giving legal that's advice. That's a good question. Okay. Giving legal advice should be a lawyer. Has that. Okay? Just be clear that. You're giving legal advice. I'm giving legal advice. I'm giving advice from how to get a mailing policy. True. You're giving advice. Advice turns into a legal matter. They're going to that, if they want to make it a legal matter, that's fine. I'm just trying to get them signed for a one stop policy. I'm just, I'm just making it clear as day to everyone that when we say words, they have value of weight, right? Like gold. Is this real gold or is it fake gold? Fool's gold, okay? So I'm doing this clear in the line that if you're going to say something and then advise it to legal team, because everyone has a legal team. Or HR, or co clients. I don't know. I see that it doesn't make yeah, the, the, the mail policy, it's the issue with uh, no, no, signing up as a resident. I'm just saying yeah. the whole picture of uh, it's, it's a legal issue. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And, and I mean, saying, like, you guys are mandated up, reporters, yeah. and I'm giving you evidence right now that this man and his agency is harming minors yes. in, in, in your county. We're, we're talking food, water, and bathing. You guys are mandated reporters. Are you going to do anything about this? Or is this just kind of all for show and this like big virtue signal of, oh, look, we, we go out and we help the homeless, right? Like the hell they just passed out. They take their kids, but we won't They're help still them. criminals, 
They're passing out gifts. Give me. It's Christmas time. Everyone gets a fucking hey, package. Hey, Doc. Um, like, come on. How man. would we? How would we get the extra time? Would we have to write a prescription for it? Like, how would that work? Well, it's, um, it's kind of a okay. Can you, is it okay? Can you have a private conversation with the other doctor? Oh well, uh, she's okay. the one with the hours. Okay, I, I'm not. It's, he can have a private. Are you feel comfortable doing that? Perfect. All right. So I mean, I, I think we're essentially. Do, do you mind? You know how you get the paperwork? Yeah, I, I, I don't essentially kind of done with this. Out. Yeah. How you doing, sir? How's it going, man? How are you? Good. Well, we've never met. My name's Jason. Jeffrey. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hey, in, uh, in Santa Monica, there is the Church of Satan giving out socks to the homeless. <laughs> I told my family, I was like, we will never accept socks from Satanists. There's too much attached to that, you know? But if they don't want to buy it, then you know? Yeah. She, she, she ate, what was it, like uh, six seeds of the pomegranate? That's why we have one church, right? <laughs> Yeah, it's just it's hard to take him seriously. Like, you know what the fuck is in the team. You yeah. just come out here singly with that. Oh, look, 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 Do you have any questions I can answer for you? Or? No, sure. Do you understand what's going on here? Hmm? Do you? I, I don't have any questions. Yeah. And, and again, I have Can you live over there? Huh? I don't answer questions. If I make you guys upset, I'll sit. I'll stand over there. No, is, 